My name is Luca Milcovano, and I am 16 years old. I am currently studying in Rotterdam at Wolfer Bilingual High School. When I grow up, I would like to be a university professor or a researcher in languages. My dream for, for the future metropolis is for them to become more sustainable and invest in environmental friendly buildings with rooftop gardens. Cities where diversity is seen as an opportunity and where people can enjoy equal opportunities. A city where people are educated to care for each other and to care for nature. My wish for the kids of the future is to make them proud of our legacy and to inspire them to live a sustainable life that will last forever. My name is Pons Bamenga. I'm 37 years old. I'm born in Kinshasa, Zaire. In my early childhood, I experienced poverty, injustice, and exclusion. For 16 years, I lived as an undocumented migrant here in Europe. My only wish for the future was to be treated equally as a human being in rights and in dignity, and to live in a society which is just and inclusive. This experience had shaped me. It did not break me, but it made me an ambassador for inclusivity, for human rights, and a fighter for justice. My name is Adeline Bredenort. I'm 43 years old. I was born and bred in a small village near Utrecht. And actually, I had a very happy childhood. In the month that I turned 18, I went to a city. I thought then, a big city, Leiden, to study theology and political sciences. It was my, my wish then, but still, that all people have the opportunity and the possibility to become the best version of themselves. And I'm inspired by the idea of being a good ancestor. And what that means, I will explain later during this ceremony. Thank you, Luca. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you for having me. Thank you. Like all of you in the audience, the three of us have our own personal story. But for all of us, experiences in our younger years have shaped us and will continue to shape us in the future. We had dreams that turn into ambitions and ambitions that turn into actions for a better future. Welcome. Welcome to all of you. Welcome to the university's birthday. We are going to have a wonderful program for you. We will introduce two honorary doctors, award no less than three prizes, and we will have very special keynote speakers and great music. All the way from the Ukraine by Inoisom. I have the privilege to be your moderator on this 109th Dias Natalis of the University, Erasmus University, Rotterdam. Welcome to you and to the people who are watching as well via our live stream. And I want to start by welcoming once again your, our first female rector magnificus, Anneline Bredenoord. Thank you. Thank you, Mapanzu, and also on my behalf, a very warm welcome to all our students, members of the academic community, support staff, guests from the city of Rotterdam, and friends of the universities. University, congratulations to our 109th DS Natalis. It's also your birthday party. 
The theme of today is building resilient and inclusive citizens, cities and societies for future generations. 50% of the world's population is now living in cities. 50%. This includes many children and young people. How can we, as a university, generate the knowledge that can impact these many lives? How can we foster sustainable, green, inclusive and smart cities where people live, create, work, love and enjoy life and where children can grow up safe, happy and with resilience? Those are the questions that we pose today. We aim to be a civic university strongly connected to the world outside academia and co-creation is one of our key methods of generating new insights. Let's enjoy today's festivities because of the uh, Dies Natales. Thank you. <laughs>